But Justin, it's been a long career, a long career. And 12 years later, after winning your first world championship, you're back here again on the top. How did you get in the blocks in this big moment with everything on the line and make this happen? I didn't think about myself. I thought about my parents in the stands. I thought about all my supporters back in the hotel, all my countrymen who are watching at home, and those who counted. I didn't do it for me. All the times I've lost to Usain and, and I've gotten silver and bronzes, today I just went out there and I just did it for others who really wanted me to go out there and do it. But I know deep down inside there must be a significance that we don't understand in the fact that you came from behind and you were able to get Bolt in his final 100 meters. You know, I couldn't see anything from lane eight. And I know at the point in time when we the starting line, it was a, a Coleman and Usain Bolt show. Um, I know I had somewhat of an advantage out in lane eight, but also I had a disadvantage because I couldn't see them. So I just ran for my life. At one point, you fell down to the track, and we saw the emotion in your eyes. Can you just explain what that meant to you with everything you've been through in your career? I dreamed about this day. I worked hard for this day. And it took for me to not be selfish and think about myself and to think about others to give me that fight. And that's what mattered the most. Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you, America!